Well, one of the great sports stories this fall has been the turnaround of the Texas College football program. In Coach Jarrell Jackson's third year at the helm, the Steers are having their best season in almost 20 years. Here's the story on how the Steers are finding success on the gridiron for the first time in a long time. It was rough, man, getting, getting our buzz beat every weekend. The struggle has been real for the Texas College Steers football team, which won a combined two games over their previous two seasons. But the Steers have flipped the switch this season, channeling that frustration into a determination to handle business on the football field. I think we were just all focused on not losing, like not trying to go in games and not lose, just fight together, be together, play together. The Steers have won together six times this season and are six and two and bowl eligible for the first time since 2005. Steers head coach Jarrell Jackson, who's in his third season at the helm and his staff deserve a lot of credit for the turnaround. We got our own little culture and, and the guys get after it and to see it, to see it come where it is now is great. We, we, we know that first win, I cried. They told me I cried after that first win, but uh, those guys have been playing well and they've been going after and they've been taking care of each other. What Jackson has built at Texas College goes beyond just football. It's about setting his guys up for success on and off the field. A couple words they can't say. If they say it, they got 50 push-ups. We do the same thing in the game. I tell the officials, hey, if they say this, they say that, come to the sideline, we'll take them out. Uh, we make them go to chapel. They'll go to chapel today. We had a uh, success uh, Wednesday. We make them dress up and, and look the part. For the Steers players, they're hoping this season spurs more investment into the football program, which has been over overlooked and underfunded in the past. It makes us want to push harder to get more things and hopefully people can sponsor us and get us to get new brand new things and just make the school more vibrant. <laughs> we got some more people coming up to the games and hopefully the success uh, will make kids want to kids want to come here. You know, we're in a good spot, Tyler, uh, not too far from Dallas, not too far from Houston and you got, of course you got East Texas. So hopefully, you know, in the future we, we get some more people, get some more kids to come here.